Hello neighbors, today we're gonna do some tteokbokki, but we're not gonna do the normal like really spicy tteokbokki. We have recipes for that, but today I wanna bring it a little smooth. I wanna do rosé, rosé. We're gonna take some heavy cream and milk and mix it with gochujang, and the two flavors, they're gonna mellow each other out. It's like when a young go-getter meets a, a pretty young lady, he calms down. He doesn't have to take over the world anymore, right? Just, just, just mellows out. Enjoyable for everybody. The only must-have ingredient today is, of course, tteokbokki, which is Korean rice cakes. It's usually sold frozen, and we want to get it in some water. I'm gonna do around two cups worth. It's gonna be a good two-person portion. Ah, these tteokbokki are really small, the cute kind. I like these cute kind. It's rock solid, and if you put that into the broth, it's gonna take too long, and the broth is gonna reduce too much, so we're just letting them thaw. For cream-based tteokbokkis, we like to use some broccoli. Again, the ingredients I'm using, use all of them, some of them, or none of them. It's all up to you. Good enough for me. We'll cut the larger broccolis into smaller broccolinis. Then about a third of an onion. Cut this into small pieces. Then to flavor the oil in the beginning, we're going to use around three cloves of garlic. Let's chop this up thinly. Then of course, it's fun to have a little bit of meat in the tteokbokki so you can pick at it. I'm gonna just work with a small handful of sausages. I love these uh, little Vienna sausages. You can just use your local sausage. I would measure up to your pointer finger and then slice them very thinly and that should give you enough. Or scratch all of this and do two strips of bacon. I like to make little slits on these. Nice. Finally, I'm gonna throw in some fish cake. It is tteokbokki. Again, if you have this, chop this up very simply. We'll cut this into small rectangle pieces. This is called amuk in Korean. If you're gonna have tteokbokki, you gotta have a boiled egg in there. Hard boil or soft boil an egg. But before we do, remember our broccoli. I'm gonna give our broccoli around 30 seconds in this. All right, All right that should be good enough. We're gonna finish cooking them in our sauce later. Then let's get these eggs going. I think two should be good. Oh, it's coming off beautifully today. It's gonna be a good meal. <laughs> All right, let's get our cream tteokbokki on the show. Little bit of vegetable oil. So let's get this thing well coated. Garlic in, as well as our onions. Of course, our sausage or your bacon. Ah, I'm excited. Let's move this around. Let's get this guys going. Of course, our tuck, our rice cake, we'll empty this out. Get it ready for stir frying. And once the onions start turning translucent, we're gonna add in some heavy cream. 3 fourths cups worth and add that in and then we're going to add another 3 fourths cup of regular milk. It's around 3 fourth cup. Mix that in. Let the two come together. And then of course our gochujang. One and a half tablespoons. That's one. Drop that right in there. And then the other half. Get that pea. And then we want half a tablespoon of Korean gochugaru flakes. Then break that gochujang down, rub it in and it's gonna come together marvelously. Now we're gonna add in our rice cakes. And then we'll let this cook and reduce until these rice cakes start to turn soft. All right, very simple yes, The color is changing, beautiful. Now you're getting that slightly orange slash reddish color. All right, and these little boys are getting soft, very nice. Let's add in our broccoli so we get some color into this as well, as well as our egg. Nice, very nice. And then of course, our amok pieces. We might not add all of it, just a little bit. Yeah, I'm gonna just end up using one sheet. Guys, move this around. Now, don't forget, we need to add a little bit of salt and pepper since we haven't seasoned this. A Little bit of salt, about two large pinches, and then a few pinches of black pepper. Oh my gosh, just look at that. I think this is done. You can add a slice of American cheese. You know the sandwich slices. I'm gonna just add a handful of this um, Colby cheese. Wow, and that is it, my friends. We're done here. The show is done. It's time to eat. Wow. You see how this sauce has turned very creamy? Let me give it a taste. No, I just want to taste this by itself first. That way. Oh my god. It has just the right amount of spice from the regular tteokbokki, but it's very creamy. I purposely bought some Parmesan Reggiano. All right, guys, just a little bit. Who am I kidding? A lot. <laughs> Parmesan cheese like that on top. And my favorite part, of course, is our eggs. Wow. Let's break that in. Yes. Yes. Come on, my friend. Yes. Yes. One of my tteokbokki. You dip it in the eggs. Then we take a little bit of our broccoli and... 
This is too good. And allow me to go in for our sausage. It's my favorite part. Yo! Mm. Mm. 